easiest way to make a quick and interesting background is by using a shape to create a pattern on the page. Start by using a new document. The size you decide to make the initial pattern will also determine the size of the pattern in your final document. I'm going to start by making a one by one blank page at 200 dpi so it's printable quality. I'm going to use a custom shape for this example. When you click on the custom shape tool on the lower left hand side, there are many different categories to choose from. I like the ornaments category for a good selection of pattern ready shapes, but you can select the shape of your choice. It's best then to set the default colors to black and white so they're easy to work with, and then start by clicking and dragging the shape out to pretty much fill the page. I would like you to leave a little space at the corners so that this shape doesn't touch at the corners when the final pattern is complete. The custom shape tool makes a more advanced graphic and needs to be simplified before moving on. To do this, just right click on the shape layer and choose simplify layer from the drop down menu. Click on the eye to the left of the background layer to make it transparent. Go to the edit menu and select define pattern. I'm going to name this pattern Flower 1. I'm now going to create a background page to place my pattern on. In the File menu, choose New and then Blank Page. In order to test my pattern, I'm going to make my page 4 by 6 and 200 dpi. Name your background whatever you like. Go to the Edit menu and choose Fill Layer. In the dialog box that appears, find Contents and choose Patterns from the drop down menu. Then from the Custom Pattern menu, select your pattern. Your pattern is now complete.